pay you! You're just a bully, Alexandria. Scudders! I'm sorry, guys. I hope you'll be able to get over this jealousy of Alexandria soon. Um, Scotty, I'll catch up. I have some harsh things to say and I don't want you to see me mad. Now that is taken care of. Never liked that gullible little popularity magnet. So this is the side of you that is mad? Fine, I never liked you. Sorry, but I'm done with this. I never think to do with you. Worst decision of your life! set out last night. It had a stain on it. That was the design. Oh yeah, I forgot tie dyes a pattern, sorry. What am I gonna wear to school? Didn't you see the outfit that I set out for you? Mom, I'm sorry, but only geeks wear that kind of thing. Please help me. Sweetie, I've washed all your other clothes. They're in the washer right now. You're just gonna have to wear that today. Uh, but it's my first day of school. Okay, just look on the bright side. Look on the bright side. Okay, there's only a geeky side to this. Hi. Um, hi. It's gonna be my first day at Wet Paw High. So, um, any tips? Here's a tip. Never talk to me unless if you suddenly become popular. Okay. Okay, let's go. Whatever. Hey, can I sit here? Excuse me? May I sit here? Sorry. Not. Only people who are somebody can sit here. Disappear. Okay. Don't even think about asking. Hey, you can sit over here. Well, I guess it would have been stupid to expect a better seat. Okay. Now I can finally talk about the latest episode of Rami the Super Guy. <laughs> Aye, we're here. Well, 
welcome to Wet Bar High. Welcome to Wet Bar High. Whoa. Just gonna stare at it or you're gonna go in. Huh? Oh, um, who are you? I'm Scotty. Scotty Malicon. Ah, oh, I'm Whitney. Whitney Castifer. So I've never seen you before. First day? Yeah, me and my mom just moved here two weeks ago. Well, good luck surviving this place. Indeed. she be? What's up with her outfit? Is she trying to start a new trend? I'm not sure if it's gonna work or not. I kind of like her style. Me too. Where is she from? How old is she? Oh my goodness, everybody's gossiping about someone other than me. I don't know who she is. Why is everybody talking about me? Hey, let's go talk to the new girl. You can do it yourself. I think I want to stay here. You can't let your shyness rule your life. I don't want to come. Nilly. Hi, I'm Vanilla, but you can call me Nilly. <laughs> Hi. See, she's shy too. Okay, say hi, it'll be good for you. Hi, uh, I'm Mandarin. <laughs> Personally, I'm not shy except when making new friends, but I think we'll still have a lot in common in the area. Yeah, so what's your, your name? My name's Whitney. I just moved here recently. Cool, we'll show you around. Okay. Well, that's our popular friend, Scotty. He just recently went through a breakup, so he's free. It, it was really nice of him because the girl he was dating was really m m m mean to us. Oh yeah, I saw him when I was walking in. Was he nice? He did tease me. Weird. Now, there's Alexandra and her minions. We call them the Des. Why do you call them that? Because they say duh a lot around everybody popular. Well, I think I've met Alexandria too. I think I saw her on the Des. I mean, bus. Was she mean to you? Yeah, she was mean. Phew, I thought everything was going opposite in the world. I mean, you would think Scotty would be really happy about the breakup. But anyway, Alexandria is our rock. She'll always have that snot kind of personality. In fact, she was the old girlfriend. Really? Yeah, and it was so nice of him to break up with her. His popularity charts went through the roof when he was with her. She's the most popular girl in school, you know. Anyway, so how popular are you guys? I mean, you're friends with Scotty. You must be like really popular. Geek level. As in Zippo. But that's impossible. You guys are so awesome. I guess I'll just have to go undiscovered until we graduate. Anyway. So, uh, I think we have lunch together, right? I have second lunch. What about you? Yep, us too. See you then. Yeah, well, I think I got a class. Bye. Bye. Let's hope Alexandria isn't mean to her in her class. N knowing Alexandria, she probably will be. Hey, is this class 16? Ah, oh, Whitney Castifer, yes it is. 
I'm afraid, Delilah, that you're going to have to continue after class. But he's probably going to ask me to the dino park after lunch. Be seated! Now, class, this is Whitney, Whitney Castifer. She just moved here two weeks ago, but she was homeschooled for two years, which means she doesn't know what high school is like. So be good! Now, um, Whitney, welcome to Whitmaha. You can sit right next to Scotty. Alexandria, can you please move to make room? Oh no. Oh yes, move it, drama queen! Ah! Thank you. How are you going to fart your way back to popularity now? And now, oh man, um, I think I forgot the cotton balls for this project. Well, um, while I'm out getting a quick trip to the store, you are free to talk while, um, uh, Mr. Freeman takes over. Mr. Freeman! Mr. Freeman, get in there. Oh, uh, oh, well, um, be quiet and behave. Oh, yeah. So, Scotty, I've met your friends Mandarin and Vanilla. They aren't matchmaking again, are they? No offense, but I'm really not in the mood for a new girlfriend right now. Oh, goodness! I didn't mean that at all. Although, they did try to play Cupid. Oh, I hate it when people do that. I know. I mean, I can find a great guy by myself. And the worst part is that then it's hard to become friends with the person that they introduced you to. Hey, I know. We can teach them a lesson by becoming friends during lunch. That'll show them. Okay, see you then. Hi, Whitney Wright. Could you come over here for a sec? Give me my seat back this instant, or you're going to be my enemy, and you really don't want that. Um, it's a desk. You don't have to make death threats over it. So you'll give it? Let me think. No. You are so dead at lunch. You and what army? Um, Mrs. Creeboar, please go back to your seat before I have to report you to the principal. Hey guys, what are you doing? Eating lunch. But Scotty isn't here yet. Well, let's hope Alexandria isn't giving him any trouble. life treating you or should I say the school just fine seems that the news hasn't even spread nobody even cares if I'm with some stupid person like you you're the ones who's stupid once when the news has spread everyone will hate you come back before anyone gets hurt stop it I don't want to hear it OMG there has got to be a way that is faster to get him crawling back. Man, Alexandria is terrible. She just won't cut it out. This is getting really annoying. Does this happen all the time? Ever since he broke up with her, she thinks he's coming back. What a crazy. Well, she can't ruin our lunch if we forget about her. You're really good at looking at the bright side, aren't you? I found you can be invincible if you don't care what anyone else does. Well, that's a pretty troublesome philosophy when everybody's beating you up. Huh, I guess you're right. I don't really have trouble with bullies. Well, you do now. Alexandria never stops until the other person's life is ruined. Speak of the devil. Hey, I just noticed your guys were sitting with my guy. Give him up or you'll get your faces smashed in. Uh, uh, Vanilla will fight you. 
Oh, please. Nobody can stop Alexander when she gets going. Yep. Oh, really? Um, Whitney, I would leave this to us. Oh, please. If we have to ruin you too, we don't have a problem with it, Alexander. Yeah. You are sure? I don't want you to regret this. Oh, please. Stop acting like you're all that. Well, I'm really sorry about this, Alexander. Um, uh, goodbye. Whoa. When you said you didn't have trouble with Baldies, you weren't kidding. What? I took some classes. Not a big hoot. It is a hoot. Alexandra will never bother us again with you around. I think I feel a friendship growing already. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, please.